Yo, welcome back everyone, this is JP here with PSG, bringing you some more Way of the Hunter on the PS5 as we are in Nesperce Valley. We've been here the whole time. Got some Yuli over here. We got a three-star mature, a one-star young, and a two-star mature. He's looking kind of grayish, but I think he's still got plenty of color in him, so I'm going to kind of see where this guy progresses to. He's eating right there, so let me see here. Is this part of... He's right there. Trying to figure out who which group this might be. Um, I don't know. Probably this group, honestly. It's probably so I have to remember that. And try to come back for them again. Uh we have some more mule deer right on the other side of this hill, I believe. So I'm trying to make my way over here. I heard that's a lot farther than what that female was. Oh, they were right there. Dang it, man. Not sure. Let's see. Let's start adult. Okay, well, I mean, we, we got to see some, uh, Good size bucks we're getting around here. So that's good to see. You know, we're making progress. Oh, we got a four star whitetail, which uh, here shortly we'll be going back to the cabin to uh, put in. And look at that. Two star mature mule deer. Oh, this is the same. <laughs> I'm an idiot. I thought they were farther over that way for some reason. Uh, but yeah, it just shows you that we're making progress on uh, managing our herds and that we're doing it pretty pretty good you know not the best but pretty good uh, we have definitely taken out some that we shouldn't have and uh but we've taken out a lot more that should be taken out so uh yeah we're going to go up to the cabin put our four star whitetail in and then uh, i have something planned for today um nothing huge but um uh, enough uh something new you know and then uh this might be the last video on this purse valley for just a little while now i'm trying to debate do i want to put this guy i think i'm gonna put him on a mount somewhere like up here do i have three white tail no, I have, I have one, um, that's okay, can I put a white tail here? I don't think I can, I think I've looked at that before. Okay, I hate... Do I put him up now or do I wait? That is the question. And it's a very important question because I want to put him. Oh, I can only put mountain goats up there. Well, that's good to know. Or do I put our first white tail right here? Can I take him down later? I, I, I don't know. It's so hard to choose, you know what I mean? Like, okay, you can taxidermy them again later, so. Three mule deer, three white tail deer. I have mule deer. Let me just see here. Uh, 
Actually, no, I don't want to do that. Where's this mule deer I have? Alright, we have the white-tailed deer calm. How come when I go to when I see the mule deer it doesn't give me that option? I like the fleeing one. Yeah, but I'm not sure. I want to save that for uh, a five a five star. So let's just put him down here somewhere for now. That's mountain goats. There we go. Oh, I can only do three white de deer fleeing. So, yeah, screw it. I think I'm gonna put him right there. All right, let's look at him just for a second here. Oh yeah, see if if I didn't tell you he's a four star, you'd probably think he's a five star. So we got a four star, uh, white tail. We got the two. Well, he's a one star and a two star. Uh, right there, in Hollywood, we got the five star mountain goat. We have a five star badger. We have a four star wild duck and then we have a five star bighorn which I wish this was facing the other way but it's fine uh, either way. So we're down here by the water just make sure look at there. Let's go check that dude out. What is the purpose? We're going to hurry up go down there check him out. And we got some pretty good sized mule deer here. Don't know if these are the same ones we've looked at, but let's see if we can call one of these guys in. A lot of these guys are adults, which is fine. No big deal. None of them seem to be reacting to low fitness call. Which is a pretty good sign. Which means uh, we'll probably leave all these guys alone. He doesn't exactly look even. He's pretty small, but he's young. Um, that guy looks good. That one star adult. He honestly looks pretty good. What is that? It's a female. These guys don't look bad. I mean, none of them do. He looks pretty good. What is he? One star adult. Okay, yeah, we're going to leave them alone. Alright guys, so we are here at this new cabin. I've not been here yet. I bought the thing for it, but... Let's uh, look here. Busting Dustin. Where are we called? Where is this place called? I don't know, let y'all pause that. Tread softly. Harvest a male elk with a shot of from 109.36 yards or less. So what is this place called here? Dustin's Cabin. Okay. We already have permission to hunt here. So if we literally walked out and seen elk, it would be good to shoot it. But we are going to kind of go this way. I like how open this little area is, honestly. Uh, it's, it's pretty nice, pretty pr beautiful looking. I do want to show y'all one thing. I do plan on going up this little trail here. It goes up over here, and we have this like nice looking pond area. And a bunch of like mountain ranges back here. And it does kind of come back over here, so... Um, yeah, thought that was pretty nice, and if we can't get an elk while we're here, then, uh, we'll probably just go to Yee Lake, but, uh, I'm gonna look around. Alright guys, I'm trying to do this, uh, hit an elk 
with a shot from 109.36 yards or less. <clears throat> and, uh, yeah, to be completely honest, it has been a bit of a challenge. So I'm just trying to get over here as close as I can possibly get without alerting them. The closer I can get, the better here. Alright, this guy's coming towards me. I'm gonna keep calling towards him a little bit. Let me just see here. Two forty there's no way it's two hundred and forty three yards. He's at 140 to 160 now. Yeah, I think he just took off. I don't mean to keep doing that. This is probably like the most boring thing y'all could possibly look. Oh wait, that was... Alright, 120 to 140. We're getting really close. He's calm, so that's good. <laughs> Oh wait, is he? No, he's alerted, it says. Which sucks, because I don't want him alerted. One star young, I definitely don't want to take him out. So a two star mature, I think I might end up taking him out. And we're just going to hope he's under or right at 50%. This is extremely, extremely hard to do. I'm kind of surprised. 
at how hard it is here to get this close. Um, I was hoping calling them in and make them come a lot closer to me. Surprised they still don't know I'm here. Alright, let's try to call them in again while they're kind of moving. I have this one star mature, he's like right here. Now come on over and see me, big guy. It says you're 100 to 120. Come on. <laughs> He's right here. He's a one star adult. That's fine. Oh, there's two of them. A two star mature. I want that two star mature. I don't know if it's a good idea to call these guys in even more. No. <laughs> That's good blood. Yep, he dropped right there. <clears throat> That's good blood. Hey, we got the heart. That is a perfect heart shot, but we were laying down, of course. Two star, 46.75%. Nice, we only lost nine pounds. Awesome, so let's uh, sell him. There we go, we got that done. And uh, let's go ahead and go back. Yeah, I obviously came up to ye. Uh, East cabin. Uh, where's that at? It's over here. We'll go see what the next little challenge is over there. What's that elk? Sure is, man. I looked everywhere for elk over here. Makes me mad. Mm. Okay, uh, these are usually nothing major, so I'll just kind of do this on my own. Alright, guys, so we did go up here to this pond area as you see I went to the left there are gray wolves up there uh, I actually seen the elk on this side we had a three star mature um, and I did a I had three star mature two two star matures and a two star adult and I did a low fitness score or low, low fitness call it no came to me I seen bighorn 
but I just kept spooking them and they kept running away. So uh, maybe I'll see them later on down the road. But we're back here at Dustin's cabin. Let's see what the next thing he wants me to do is. Let y'all uh, pause that. Harvest the aggressive bear. Alright, it's over here. So let's do this. Oh, I do that every time. It's not too far. Is this parking? Where's the parking sign? There it is. Just want to look across here real quick. Alright, we're going to go get this aggressive bear. I'll see y'all there in just a second. I think we got him. I'm pretty sure this is him. That's a lot of blood. I'm just going to follow him. Did he just go down? Start young. Okay, so I lost my bear. It's okay though, we'll find him. Alright, guys, so, uh, yeah, we, uh, shot this dude. Where was it exactly? Uh, right there somewhere, I think. Maybe, like, right there. Like, uh, yeah, I mean, either way, it was all the way over there. It took me all the way down and across here. And here he is. So this is supposed to be an aggressive bear. We had a lot of bone. Um, he is a four star. He's 80%. So he wouldn't have got any better than this. But uh, 38 minutes of tracking. That's crazy. We are going to taxidermy him. And uh, yeah. Uh, we are going to call that it for this. Uh, well, actually, you know, we'll go back to the cabin real quick. Alright, let's see what we have left here. There you go, brother. You're even better than me. You're welcome to use my lamp for the your friend. Alright, well, guys, that means officially there are no more story missions left, I believe, here. Unless we still have something, do we? I know I still have that. It's a hard one to do. I mean, we'll eventually get it, but. Uh, harvest through Ross's geese from 54.6. I guess that's 54.68 or longer. Harvest a single. Harvest a moose after a single shot without using a scope. That'll be pretty easy. Lesser scalp. And uh, shoot five airborne lesser scalps. 
Uh, but that is gonna do it for this video, guys. So if you don't mind, if you enjoyed the video, please smash the like button as every like helps. If you're new to the channel and you want to see more by me, hit subscribe and trigger that bell icon so you can stay up to date on every video I upload. Till next time, guys, this is JP with PSG saying peace out and have a wonderful day.